Ed was here. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, and further on down, his marking says, Ed fell here. Ed fell here. And I, have, I want to find him one time. <laughs> it's up there in the dark. Oh, man. Ed was here. Ed fell here. You reckon that was from the Civil War? I don't know where it was from, but probably pre-1940. Gotcha. I don't know where it was at. Just somewhere in this passage. Did, did you say they just allowed people just to walk on their own before in the 40s? No. With no, guide? no, they would allow you to take stuff out of the case. Gotcha, gotcha. They didn't know the value and how long it took to form back then. You tip the guy. Back before the Civil War, your guy was probably a slave. Oh, wow. Any tips they got that you keep. I see Dan, 1934 up there. It's up there, Dan, 1934. Maybe it was Dan. Yeah, I said Dan. All I saw was Dan, 1934. I don't remember where it was at. Come back down here sometime. Gotcha. I was doing some training with the ranger, and we got to kind of walk through our own base. And yeah. Found that stuff. You go to group, you don't get a chance to look. Around. No, no. I'm trying to manage some of the other things. No. Nope. A very narrow window I have to keep too. Exactly. I had another group. Did they ever let you guys come down here on your own and well, just? You can, you can take after hours tours. You get them approved, and a senior ranger will take and junior people down. There. Places that we don't take you guys. Gotcha. I've got been down the river twice. Uh huh. But we just can't go there with civilians. Gotcha. So you've been in it twice in the river park? It's about three miles back there. The oh, wow. There's some old. Oh, I thought it was an old light for a second. We find light bulbs all in the corners there. Really? There's some trash. Oh, no, it's a rock. That's pretty interesting. Yeah. We just did the construction project to clean it all Oh, okay. Four hundred million years. That's wild when you just fathom that in your head, you know. <laughs> That's just crazy. Four hundred million years ago this formed. Well the rock. How how long ago you think when the water cut through? The geologists say it took about ten million years to make form. Ten. Uh, six, six to four has been dry form. So it took ten million years to form it? Six to form and four to dry four. Gotcha. It's been dry for four. Oh sure. okay. So six million to form and four to dry. Awesome. Sands of time, one grain at a time. Oh, right, right. Exactly. I got you. No, no, especially in this area, you got to be careful. <laughs> well, that's why he fell, right? <laughs> Dan fell here. I wonder if his buddy, his buddy wrote that, I'd say. <laughs> Dan fell here. <laughs> yeah. Well, now, I was told, I don't know if the lady was full of it, at the Lost Sea Adventure, she said that you couldn't get drunk that far underground. I was like, come on. You said a cave guy wouldn't tell you the truth? Yeah, <laughs> you know. Yeah, she said, yeah. So they'd drink it, and then they'd go up and get really drunk. I'm like, okay. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. She had to be pulling our leg. But we're all like, really? She says, yeah, like that. And I'm like, oh. <laughs> exactly, exactly. She did a good job. <laughs> we don't always let all the facts get away with a good story. No, exactly. Got to embellish a little bit. You got it. You're good. You're a great tour guide. I've enjoyed it. I reckon there's probably some big old caves in Africa, you know, that probably never even been found as big as that continent is. Wow, look at this room. Holy cow. Woo! Woo! There you go, you want your echo. Woo! <laughs> <laughs>
I'm going to give it a rebel yell. <laughs> Primarily, uh, the Union most of the time, but it was very Yeah. Yeah, because most of Oh, okay. Yeah, because most of Kentucky stayed with the Union, correct? Yeah, all of them. Oh, got Grant came through and took Bowling Green and went down to uh, took Fort Donaldson, Fort Henry before he went to Vicksburg. Oh, yeah, Vicksburg's where the South lost. Once we lost Vicksburg, it was over. They'd hired a general from Pennsylvania to protect it, and people were like, okay, that was a setup. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was when the war was over, when Vicksburg was lost. Yep, me too. Same here. Try to respect them both. Although here lately, they only want to respect one side. Almost our next Cool. Probably walk what about a mile total from that stop to here. Gotcha. Oh yeah. Yeah, I didn't got my counter on, so. We're almost halfway. Ah, I need some exercise anyways. I'm trying to get this chubby off of me. No, heck no, heck no. I'm gonna when I I'm 55. When I hit 60, I'm cutting back to part time. I ain't doing full time. Oh, there's some writing. Next year's my magic year. Yeah, you gonna draw it? I W Ryan. Do you know who I W Ryan is? Irene Ryan. Bring a bell. Irene. Right. Hmm. You do what you don't. No, I know Ian Ryan, but I don't know Irene Ryan. Anybody know who Irene Ryan was? No. no. Yes, you do. I do. Yeah, most everybody does. Oh, okay. Yes. Yeah. That was her real name, wasn't her stage name? Oh. She was a vaudeville star. She's still in that for a minute. <laughs> Bob's she was on a 60s TV show. Irene Ryan. Wow, here's a big area. Oh. Irene Ryan. So that would have been what, the 20s? In the 20s and 30s, she was a vaudeville star. 20s and 30s. And she made it again on TV in the 60s. Oh. Huh. Very popular TV sitcom. Think that be. It wouldn't be Bewitch's mom, would it? Uh, no. It's not her. Brady Bunch, Partridge Family? Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> that looks cool. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Sure. I sure will. Sure will. Tomorrow morning, I'll definitely go to sleep good tonight. If you guys 
Jeffrey's had the first thing in the back, people get down. We're going to talk about what's behind me here. Oh, wow. I can't read the writing now. There's something written on there. Oh, it's writing on there. There's something written on there. Yeah. That's in the Civil War. Yeah. Okay. Is he still coming? Yeah. Okay. Yeah.
My friends say, we're now in Kentucky Avenue. Kentucky Avenue. Sometimes called the Grand Avenue. Oh, okay. Grand Avenue. So before all the bats died, we would have probably seen some by now, wouldn't we? Probably not down here. We're, we're really far away from the exit. Oh, okay. Not out of the realm of possibility. I've never seen one down here. Gotcha. No, I'm not here every day. For five years I've not seen one. Okay, cool. But you never know. You never know. You never know. That's right. We really haven't had hibernation season yet, so this is just now starting to come back. Oh, okay. See, I would have thought since the cave temperature was the same, they wouldn't have hibernated. In the wintertime, they hibernate. In the I'll cave. be darned. How about that? Summertime, they spend outside in the trees. Oh, you know, some learning all kinds of stuff. I didn't know they ever went outside in the trees. I thought they stayed in the back no, cave. They don't live in caves. I'll be doggone. There's no food down here. Yeah, I just figured they flew out, got their food, and came back here and slept. You know, like a vampire movie, you know? That's how they always do it. Get their blood and then go back. Yeah. I got some trees with me. Let's see if they <laughs> bring them up here. <laughs> How the heck did you get down here? I don't know. One of those uh, cave stories. <laughs> Probably just got junk and couldn't get back out. Whew. A little dark here, a little dark. A little dark, a little dark. Whew, there we go. Here, get it, get it, get it, get it. It usually runs out, we bring treats to it down here, so it usually runs out to see it, so simply find it. It's Felix the cat. He got tired of show business, retired down here. <laughs> Where are you? Four on the part five. 